Good afternoon, Gabrielle. You know what? Big change for anybody who cuts it a little bit close to get on their flights heading out of here. In the next couple of weeks, anybody who uses drop off or pickup is going to have a new route. Let me show you what that's going to be. In just a couple of weeks, everybody who comes in here and tries to approach the front, they're actually going to get sent around parking garage B. That's the big white facility. They will then come up this area that is under construction. This is going to be new curbside drop off and pick up. Another important thing to note on December the 5th, all of these lanes right here, the old lanes that people have used for decades, these are going to be shut down. As part of this construction project, the lanes that are closest to the terminal here are going to get widened from three lanes to four. You want to make sure that you're continuing to give yourself enough time so that you can find your preferred parking spot, walk to the terminal, and not be delayed by any of these coming in. All right, GSP has grown substantially with the region since it was built. Some 2.5 million passengers will come through here on a yearly basis. That, of course, is bringing more congestion, especially during peak times. This is an $18 million construction project. It is going to double the length of curbside drop off and pick up when it is complete. Folks here say how much earlier should you now be arriving? They always press the fact you want to get here two hours before your flight, right? But they said go ahead and add an extra 20 to 30 minutes to this. As people get used to the new traffic configuration, you also want to try to get to the parking garages that you're used to, and there could be new pedestrian detour walkways around the construction that will be taking place. And that again could take you a little bit more time. You can visit GSP's website to see maps that will show you each part of the project step by step and help you figure out where to plan to drive and park when you get here. Reporting live at GSP, Stephanie Trotter, WYFF News 4.